So I'd say you don't have to make a decision on the spot. I think sometimes the thing that we worry about is that in that moment we should have said something. I'm not a person that ever ever says anything in a moment if someone upsets me. Partly because I I have this innate British politeness, so it doesn't happen anyway. I'm more likely to go sorry, sorry, sorry for upsetting you uh, when someone says something to me. But that doesn't mean you've lost the moment. That doesn't mean that it's gone and you've got to carry on having them be mean and horrible to you. So I would say, first of all, recognise that you deserve to be happy and you deserve to have people in your life that are kind and caring towards you as well. And then second, plan. Plan what you're going to say to them. Talk to other people. That's part of it. Um, whenever I've had an issue, I've been lucky enough that there has been at least one person I can talk to. And just talking things through with someone who you know is a close confidant and will tell you the truth and be be helpful a listener not someone who talks someone will listen that's what you need even if it's just so you can sound it out look this is how i feel this is what i'm thinking i want to say and you know what i do i then say it i like i know it sounds crazy but out loud i hold the conversation several times over out loud i mean to a point where i'll do it sometimes in the park and i'm just walking along rah, 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 and then i'll turn the corner and someone's there and I'm like oh. Sometimes I wear a headphones to make it look like maybe that's not me talking to myself. Uh, <laughs> you construct this.